left his car at that parking lot, got out. And again, just started shooting. Jerry Johnson is wounded. Officer Ron Grogan is dying. Officer Sandra Burma arrives at the scene. All I could do was call officers down and told uh, dispatch to call out SWAT. As I look to my right, towards the door, the gunman was standing there, he shot at me right through the, the window. As the gunman was walking towards the police officer, I could see the police officer looking up at the uh, gunman with that horrible look on his face face like, please don't kill me. He took the time to kill, kill the officer who had been wounded. Chopper Ruben Torres decides the police need help. Somebody has to do something. And I figured me by going to my car and getting my weapon out, I could probably stop this guy. trying to make sense of the mayhem. I probably heard uh, 15, 20 shots being fired. There's a lot of radio traffic, very chaotic. Police mistake Ruben Torres for a killer. My thought was he's, he's part of the problem. That's when I saw that he was out of ammunition, and, and I thought at that point I can't fire. Put your weapon down! Get in the your stomach! I was trying to explain to the police officer that I had nothing to do with it. They thought I was his accomplice. Bombay SWAT arrives on the scene and enters what is being called the kill zone. I could hear him firing and I was trying to call to try to get a shot. I couldn't see him. I couldn't get a shot at him. I couldn't observe him. I didn't know how many gunmen there were or anything at that point. I called it into the rest of the SWAT team who had just arrived who was able to take some of the, uh, the victims who were in the kill zone out of the, uh, the parking lot. He was shooting and with his adrenaline pump and everything, I knew that he wasn't looking for someone crawling on their hands and knees. The only thing I was thinking was to try to get the shot. Completely surrounded outside, Cruz heads into the store. The manager had locked the sliding glass doors into the store. Chaos inside the store. Manager and employees are running out toward the back, trying to make an exit. They know there's a shooter in the front.
grocery clerk Robin Brown has made the fateful decision to take a short break. She does not know what is happening outside. There's a man outside. A woman came in screaming, there's a man out there with a gun shooting people. 